Jerusalem, a historical city. If you've ever wanted to visit this city and wanted to know more about it, you should save this video. Here are a few things you should know if you've ever visited Jerusalem. Many people come here with a tour. You do not need a tour. To get here, you can just fly into Tel Aviv, rent a car, and drive about an hour, an hour and a half, and then you will be right there in the middle of Jerusalem. All of the religious or historical sites are typically free. The old city is actually stroller friendly or handicap friendly. Also, everyone here speaks English, so you will not have a hard time communicating with people. Inside of the old city walls, there are some hotels, but typically we've always stayed outside of the walls. That is because we have a rental car and there's no parking inside of the walls. I would put all the things to do in the description of this video, but real quick, one thing you can do is get a free walking tour. You can schedule those or also the top things to do and see here if you are a Christian are the Mount of Olives. You can also go see the King David's tomb. You can go and walk um, the whole procession of where Christ walked with his cross. And then you can also go to the tomb where Christ was buried. I would say two nights, three days are a perfect amount of time to spend in Jerusalem. Uh, one of the days we actually took a day trip to Abraham's land and went on some camel rides. That is a lot of fun. Make sure you reserve that in advance. Outside of the old city walls, there's also this really cool area that is more of a modern area. I'll put all of that in the description as well. Thank you. And don't forget to like this video.